Trent, finally! Why are you running so late? And what's with the hair? Come here. Oh. Lisa, are you done yet? You know, oh, this is a deja vu moment. Oh, God, listen, I'm feeling a little shaky here. Uh, my day so far has been the day from hell. Listen, has the boss been asking for me? Oh, yes, and he's oh, growing God. rather impatient to make his big announcement. Okay. We're waiting on a major stockholder to arrive. This person will help decide who gets the job. All right, how's that? Is that all right? Better. Better. Okay. Hey, Trent. Yeah. I bet you're excited about today. Hey, what happened to your lip? It looks like you've got a little cut. Denise is right, Trent. Looks like you've been bleeding. Are you okay? Oh, it's fine. And you ladies are much too kind for worrying about me. But actually, I'm just happy to be here. <laughs> oh, oh. Trent, hurry up. Mr. Milhouse is waiting and ready to begin. Okay. Lisa, look, you've always been my favorite secretary. But please, 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 don't marry Willard. Trent, what's the holdup? Everybody's waiting for you to get to the meeting. Don't be nervous. We're all like one big happy family. Come on, let's go. You know, this all seems so familiar to me. It's as though I've already done this once today. God, maybe I have. Hey, look, they painted the walls. <laughs> well, good luck in there. I'm rooting for you. Hey, aren't you forgetting something? Not that I know of. You're safely delivered to your destination. Is there something I forgot? The kiss? Don't you remember? Our secret. You're more nervous than I thought. Look, take a few deep breaths. Everything will be fine. Okay. Good luck. I'm rooting for you. Oh, I sure could have used a kiss. Come on in. The door's open. Well, good afternoon, Trent. I heard your morning was quite eventful. Uh, yes, it was. Uh, it was one morning that I would not want to repeat. How did you find out about it so fast? And it's, Willard, couldn't you have given you all the details that quickly? I'm certainly glad that everybody was able to be here today. Our company has had a wonderful and successful year, and I want each of you to realize that you had an important part in this. Since Willard Millhouse and Trent here have been part of this company, the sales have boomed. And it's for this reason that one of them is going to receive this position, this new position as, as vice president in charge of sales. They're both so close to my heart that I couldn't make the decision. So I'd like to introduce a solid partner and stockholder of our company, Ms. Ethel Sandusky. Good afternoon, Good afternoon, everybody. Good afternoon. Well, I'm here, and you're here. So, well, well thank you, Frank. I'm very pleased to be here this afternoon because I've made a very important decision that affects the future of this company. It's you. I can't believe it. You're the lady from the mall who kept watching me. And you're the hero of the card shop. And it was you who told Mr. Millhouse about the robbery. I must confess, that whole robbery was staged, except for the last two robbers. And they were the real thing. But I'm happy to say they're both in jail now where they belong. What are you talking about? You were the one laying on the floor begging for help. You mean to tell me that I risked my life for something that wasn't even real? I mean, I'm the one that got pushed and punched. I'm the one whose cell phone got destroyed. Willard, that staged robbery was a test to see how well you could handle pressure. Trent, you passed with flying colors. But Willard, you failed miserably. You fell apart. You were not a team player and certainly not a hero. Well, where did you find these robbers? Oh, funny you should ask. Robbers, would you please come in? I think you'll recognize these three. Jake, Michael, and Tom, the company painters. As for the other two robbers, we'll hear about them on the evening news. 
This was all a big act, man. You fell for it, too. And I thought she's the one who set all this up. See, I'm just a painter. And I play guitar and I sing at night in clubs and things. But uh, I do admit, when the real robbers came in, man, we were scared. See, my gun, it only had blanks. Yeah, yeah, I see y'all laughing at me. What do y'all think, this is a big joke or something? No, no, truthfully, the joke's on us. Willard, we're not laughing at you. We're laughing with you. You're a good businessman, but you're a little wet behind the ears. Trent Turner, would you please stand up? Congratulations, Trent. You're our new vice president in charge of marketing. <laughs> Matter of fact, I uh, thought that Willard had gotten the job. On the other hand, I uh, think that I deserved it. <laughs> I just want to take this opportunity to thank you very much for uh, giving me this position. I promise I'll do my best. Oh, one last thing. This is for you. <laughs> it's the card and the pen. Yes, I know how badly you wanted it. And from this old lady, never underestimate one tough old broad. Thank you, Mrs. Sandusky. <laughs> and you, Mr. Millhouse. Um, you all really made my day. And for the card, I planned to give it to my wife. So you saved my life twice in one day. One final thing, Trent. Here are your keys to the executive bathroom. Thank you, Mr. Millhouse. I'm sure I won't misplace these. <laughs> this meeting's dismissed. Everybody back to work now. <laughs> so, this is what it's like being an executive. Don't get too comfortable in that chair, Trent. It's still my chair. I'm sorry, Mr. Milhouse. It won't happen again. I promise. Okay. Now, where's that Lisa? Oh, Lisa. Are you in on all of this? Every step of the way. And I have to say that I enjoyed every minute of it. You know, I spoke to your daughter earlier, and she had no idea as to what I was planning. And as for Willard, well, he didn't just happen to be there. I sent him there. But I don't tell him. If he knew, he would hate me forever. <laughs> anyway, Trent, I just want to say congratulations. Congratulations. 